Tell me about the great fire in Rome from Discovery of New Worlds. Um, the great fire in Rome. It was like it was um there it was a fire. No one knew that there was a, who caused the fire. They thought it was me. Some some robbers were robbing the, the houses of other people when they were when it was scary, when it was scary, when it was when there was the fire and the and the people were discussing what happened why are why are there things missing that's what happened yeah and then. What did Emperor Nero do? Because the people were mad, right? So they, someone had to take the blame. What did Emperor Nero do? Who did he blame? For the his fire? brother. Was it his brother? No. There's a certain group of people that he didn't like. Uh, and he blamed it on them. Do you remember who they are? Uh, I think the, the, the group was... Catholics? The Christians, yes. He said it was them. So he, so it was uh, two apostles, Peter and Paul. Mm -hmm. What happened Peter, to them? Peter had his, he had, he got beheaded. And, no, 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 that was Paul. And then Peter got crucified. Yeah. That's it? Yeah. Okay. Well, tell me about, uh, how about 50 famous stories? Yeah. Tell me your favorite story from that so the far. Whistle. The whistle? Okay. Tell me about the whistle. The whistle. <clears throat> it was with a boy named Benjamin Franklin. And uh, when he was seven, his mom gave him a lot, some pennies, and and he and he said, "You can buy anything you want with it, but don't, don't, don't do some bad stuff." And so he was running happily. And he never had so much coins before, so he heard them. He heard them in his pocket. But he was thinking when he was running, what should I buy? Should I buy candy or should I buy a toy? Because he know his father was poor. He didn't you know very much what to do. So, uh, um. The town where he was in, um, it was a big city, but at in that Boston. time, yeah. at that time, there was a, the, it was a, like a little town. There was not many stores, but he, he heard a whistle boy. He was whistling. He looked at him, then whistled again. It was beautiful, and he said, I will trade you all the all the all the pennies I have for that whistle, and he showed them him all, and then they traded. And then. And then. He went back home whistling, and when he said, "Look what I got, mother," and he showed it to his mother. One of, one of his brothers told him he had.
had 14, um, he had 14 older brothers and, brothers and sisters, and, and he had two younger siblings. So what if his brother said, what a neat whistle, but his mom said, my dear, you could have bought some very half a dozen with those of uh, whistles with those. And when that boy, he made a mi big mistake and he didn't like it. He threw the whistle and, and he cried. He his mom said, never, never waste a lot of your pennies. And he was a wise man. Uh, he grew up to be a wise man. He grew up to be a wise man. And that, that no man could ever say.